Hi guys, happy unofficial summer kickoff. You can officially wear white, which I love. I am so excited because I want to share with you guys one of my favorite summer go-to looks, which incorporates lots of pops of colors. As you can see, aqua eyes, coral lips, bright pink cheeks, and luminous glowy skin. So we're talking less contouring, more strobing, which I'll explain more about. And I hope you guys learned some cool tips along the way. So let's get started. So I want to start with showing you guys some tips on how to get glowy, luminous skin for summer. So prepped my face with the foundation that has SPF included in it, and now I'm going to go over it with highlighter. So highlighter is kind of like my go-to look for summertime. I kind of put the contouring away. I do this thing called strobing more, which is this way of like using highlighter and bringing out your inner glow. Really quick for the morning, summer, lightweight, easy. Um, and put some highlighter on my face. It'll give me some glow and really let the like light of the sun kind of reflect off of the highlighter. Current favorite highlighter is this one from Smashbox. I love it because it's creamy and I can just like apply it really easily because it's a stick to the parts of the, my face and makes it really easy to like target. So I applied the highlighter on my cheekbones, the bridge of the nose, under the brow and then I got excited and just put it over the entire eye because I don't really want to do a heavy eyeshadow look again for summer. Um, right here on my chin and the bow of my lip. And I'm just gonna, again, keeping things simple, just use my fingers to blend everything in. One thing I did differently that I usually don't do for creamy highlighters when I put it on is I kind of didn't like soak it into my skin as much as I would and that's because I'm gonna go over it with a shimmery eyeshadow to really add that extra illumination and highlight on my skin. Again, because I'm not really doing a bronzing contouring look, I'm really playing on this idea of highlighting and making your skin glow. I'm gonna go kind of overboard with it. This shimmer shadow from Kevin O'Quan, I really like it because it has like a roller ball so I can again directly target it to my face. I don't have to have all this loose shimmery powder shadow everywhere and then I'm just gonna use my fingers to blend it all in again. Now onto the pops of color, which is so much fun because summer really is the time where you can do really fun shades that you normally wouldn't do in any other season. I'm obsessed with aqua liner right now. It's really fun way to go outside of the normal black eyeliner look that you usually have and have this like additional pop to your eyes, but also not so crazy out of comfort zone where it's like your entire eyelid is a certain color. Before I go into the pop of color with the aqua liner, I'm gonna start by lining my eyes with a black liquid liner. This one I'm using is from Ico. Alright, so now that I have the black liner on the top of my lid, I'm going to have some fun with the aqua. Um, this one's from Jane Cosmetics. I'm going to line the bottom of my eye. I know the green kind of looks a little extreme right now, but when you layer on the mascara on top of it, it kind of like calms it down a little bit. If you're really into the aqua eyeliner look and want to take these eyes to the next level, you can take the aqua liner and line the top of your liquid liner to add a more intense aqua effect. Now that we have the pop of color to the eyes, we move on to the lips. So you guys know I'm obsessed, obsessed, obsessed with lip colors. Um, and for summer specifically and with aqua liner, I love to do a coral lip. Really pigmented, make your lips pop. The colors really complement each other. So today I'm gonna use this one from Charlotte Tilbury. This is actually cheek and lipstick, but I'm gonna use it just for my lips today. To really round out this look, you can't have a pop of color without having a pop of color to your cheeks. I don't have a blush that is that bright color that I really want, but I do have a gajillion lipsticks. So NARS Shiop was actually one of the very first lipsticks I bought in my life. Um, I love this color on my lips. I think it's really fun. I think it looks great on all different skin tones. And I tried it on my cheeks once because I was so frustrated that I couldn't find an actual blush that really made my cheeks pop, and I loved it. So I'm going to show you guys how it looks. I'm going to use my fingers because I love doing that. Make yourself look like a clown. I <laughs> know, now you gotta blend.
And because it's summer and you don't want your makeup to smear and you want your face to feel nice and refreshed and hydrated, I'm gonna set my face with um, a primer water from Smashbox. Refreshed. So just to quickly recap, get luminous, glowy skin with a highlighter, less contouring, more strobing, layer that with some shimmery eyeshadow, add pops of color to your eyes with a beautiful aqua liner, pops of color to your lips, coral is really beautiful for summer, a bright pink cheek, and if you don't have the blush, use lipstick. So I hope you guys liked the final look and got some inspiration for your summer go-to makeup look. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite summer look is, I'm curious, um, and I will see you next time. Bye.